Good morning. Uh, welcome to the Open World Forum. Uh, today we have uh, Gaël Blondel from uh, BO, and we have also uh, Bruno Grasset from Valeo. Uh, both are working on uh, embedded tools and embedded system, open, uh, open embedded systems. So I would like to ask you, Gaël, what is uh, BO doing? So OBO is a, a, comp a French company specialized in uh, modeling tools and tools based on the Eclipse platform. Okay. So that's, uh, we develop tools for the developers of embedded systems. Okay, so can you ex explain a little bit what kind of uh, system uh, you target your tools? Uh, well, in, th in the context today, I, wi I will more likely talk about uh, aircraft engineering, for example, or space uh, embedded systems for space, or also uh, well, si embedded system. Well, what, uh, what other space, uh, automotive? Automotive? Uh, yes. Well. So we have uh, uh, Bruno, uh, who is working with Valeo, and uh, you explained me you are uh, doing a pretty interesting project uh, around uh, multimedia inside the car. Yes, exactly. So uh, I work uh, at Valeo as infotainment software leader, and um, I participate also in an alliance that we call Genevi. Genevi IVI, so IVI for in vehicle infotainment. So all that concerns the multimedia, the displays, the dashboards, and, uh, and so on. We are working with that, and Valeo is, is one member of that, of that alliance. And this alliance is dedicated to define and develop an open source platform for different OEMs which that are also members. Which is an approach which is uh, pretty uh, unusual with uh, That's automotive. That's completely the opposite of what we did b before. Okay. So the goal is really to to share requirements between different OEMs to say, okay, what can we have in common so that we can leverage this with the open source components to have a common platform that will be good for us and that the end user doesn't care at all. That's our concern. So you're sharing uh, information and you're uh, developing a, a standard platform with your colleagues uh, uh, automotive uh, yeah. manufacturers. Yes, our so competitors. Uh, uh, your competitors. Yeah. That are colleagues uh, uh, in, in yeah. this okay. alliance, yes. So, and, uh, so uh, it, it means that you are working on a, on a real standard infotainment platform, yes. uh, which is regarding communication and uh, uh, multimedia in the car for cars. Yes. That's pretty, pretty interesting. How, when did you create this uh, consortium? So this alliance started in, in, in 2009. So okay. more it's than pretty, three years. It's pretty old. Yeah, yeah. Now it's going to be old. And uh, it was made of different OEMs, tier ones, and um, software vendors. Mm -hmm. And we are now more than 170 members. So it's really huge. 170 members. That's yeah. pretty big. Yeah, it's really big. So it means you have uh, your competitors and also uh, uh, tools vendors and uh, tools ma uh, editors. Yes, exactly. Okay. OEMs are there, tier ones, but also open, s uh, open uh, uh, operating systems vendors. Okay. Or even independent software vendors like the guys that, that build tools or other guys that just develop uh, components. Uh, Gail, are you involved in this project a little bit? Not no, directly. not at all. But, um, but, but what is the effect of this for, for your guys uh, in terms of uh, business and companies? So seeing big uh, manufacturers doing uh, alliance mm -hmm. uh, w using open tools. I think that that's really interesting to see those uh, super communities uh, of um, and, and those user-driven super communities created uh, around open source for embedded systems. I think that uh, one of the key reasons why uh, the automotive community is working on Genevi is to have a uh, more uh, quicker uh, time to market mm -hmm. for the infotainment part. And uh, on the other side, we work more with uh, space and uh, aircraft and telecommunication guys because they, they realize that only open source software can ensure, can enable long-term support of, uh, of the tools they need, or of the tools or other, and also of the middleware. But the, the 
when I mean uh, long-term support, it's uh, support for 10 years, more or less proprietary software can be supported for 10 years, but much more than 10 years. And probably it also reduces the cost. Or it also reduces the cost of yes. developing new support for uh, the vendors, for, for the editors. Mm -hmm. Because, for instance, when you see a, a proprietary editor, he has to follow up on his system, and it's, it's a huge investment to keep going regarding the demand of the consumers. Mm -hmm. And uh, with open source, you know, it makes the, uh, de the, the research and development easier and, and cheaper. Well, all the communities in, um, in which uh, embedded system developers are, uh, are committed yeah. um, are working on two, on two sides. The, the open innovation side, yeah. I think that Genevi is really a, a good example of the open yeah, innovation exactly. side. Yeah. And, uh, and the other side is the long-term support side. It's, uh, there are initi initiatives in, lo in uh, the Linux Foundation, in the Eclipse Foundation, so both at the operating system, middleware, and tools. That's uh, the two key points which, uh, which bring those users of technologies to, to create communities to work together with providers. And yeah. that's the first, I think that's the first time we have uh, communities created in open source, uh, created by users. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, can I ask you, where, where are you in the development of your platform now? Uh, we already uh, have um, released several, um, several platforms. You have today. okay. Yeah, and, and today, and or this week, was uh, old in, in Shanghai, in China, the seventh all members meeting in Geneva, where they were released this uh, discovery, uh, Excalibur, sorry, uh, release of Geneva that um, groups different components we defined or we adopt from the open source together to, to define our reference platform. And so, for instance, can you tell me, me as a user, what could I see uh, of this platform yeah. in, in the car. That, that's exactly the goal of, of Geneva. The goal of Geneva is, is to um, define the standard on what we have all in common in the automotive industry. Mm -hmm. And this is what is differentiating and so see by the, the end user is not in Geneva. So we want to define th the platform that is below all the applications and all the things that the, the, the end user sees. Below, let's okay. let's That's define enabling. the standard. Yes, yeah. it's, it's an enabling technology. So yeah. it means you have a common enabling the platform, yeah. and then each vendor, each manufacturer, does his own uh, uh, interface with e the user, exactly. and the user see the proprietary interface, exactly. just like in the phone system, in the in the telecom Th that's telecommunication. The that's the same you approach. Have the same underlying uh, system, which is open, and you put uh, an interface uh, uh, on it. Yeah. Maybe what you can see as a user of a car is that uh, your mobile phone will connect uh, easily in Bluetooth with all the EV uh, IV enabled uh, cars. Yeah. Because that, that's uh, a part they share. Mm -hmm. the, connect the connectivity is a part they share. Okay. But and the big and issue for you is uh, reducing the cost of R&D. Yeah, that, that's one point, reducing the cost, but also increase the quality of the code, because if, if each tier one or OEM develops by its own, it's not going to be the same quality. Because if we share things, we have most users that will test the, the software and will discover bugs and so on. So we will have more uh, higher quality with that. And That's and also one thing that is we want to reduce the time to market. Because when we start to create a car, it takes us uh, about three years or four years maybe. So if we start with some technologies, Four years after, they are already obsolete. So what we need to do is to be ready to integrate, I would say, the, the most fresher, the fresh, fresher uh, technologies inside the cars. Okay, so thank you very much. Uh, You're welcome. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.